Isaiah 4.1 for seven women will take hold of one man in that day, saying, We will eat our own bread and wear our own clothes, only let us be called by your name. Take away our reproach. It is a reproach for a woman to be uncovered. It is a reproach for a woman to be single or not under the covering of a head. And this is future prophecy. This says at some point in the future that, that seven women... Now, it, that, may, that number may be specific or they, that may be somewhat figurative, but the point is multiple women will take hold of a man saying, we'll take care of ourselves. We'll eat our own bread, right? Food, clothing, conjugal rights, right? Here is, this goes back to Exodus chapter 21, verse 10. They're saying, we don't need the food. We don't need the clothing. We'll take care of those ourselves. We need the conjugal rights. We need to be under the headship and covering, and we need our reproach taken away. I've done a video in the past dealing with reproach, specifically as it relates to not having children and not being covered. That's worth taking a hard look at. So as future prophecy and as a solution for judgment in Isaiah 3, which specifically is upon a generation that is ruled by women and children and is wanton in its pleasure, sounds much like what we see today. What's interesting is that the source of the righteous daughters of Zion in Isaiah 4 is actually from this passage. The righteous women are looking for covering. The passage prophesies polygyny in the future, in a righteous context. It cannot be okay in the Old Testament, not okay now, and then okay again in the future. That just doesn't work. I, the Lord, do not change. Therefore, you sons of Jacob are not consumed. The word of the Lord stands forever. It does not change. You shall not add to nor take away from this book of the law, ever. If this has blessed you, please make sure that you like, share especially, and subscribe. And we appreciate your comments. Use the QR code on the screen to access a blog that has many resources for study and understanding. It will take you to natsav.com forward slash biblical marriage. And that will give you many more resources in addition to this YouTube channel. For King and Kingdom, I bid you shalom.